Hi guys, back again with another video. Now this time uh, it's a Q&A video. Basically a lot of people have been asking me regarding the black uh, portrait mode picture. So that's what commonly people refer that as. But it's actually a stage light and a stage light uh, mono picture. So how to take that picture? Uh, most of them whoever owns, owns a iPhone 10 from the front camera they are not able to take a good stage light picture. So uh, the problem is the stage light picture needs good uh, depth the background has to be at a certain distance if it's too far like uh, like how i'm in a garden right now uh, it will not take a, a stage light picture so how to get a stage light picture when you are in an open area where you don't really have any background close to you so how to get that so let's go ahead and see that so for this i've got a model with me uh, i have sharda so uh, she'll be helping me with the uh, stage light pictures. So let's go ahead and see uh, what the problem is and how to get a stage light pictures with the iPhone 10. Now this is for the front camera, iPhone 10, not for the uh, 8 plus uh, because that has portrait mode and, uh, on the back camera. Back camera works fine. The problem only comes with the front camera. So let's go ahead and see what to do. Okay, so let's uh, go ahead and see how to take a uh, portrait mode picture first. So Sharda, open up the camera app. So let's go into the portrait mode. Yes. So that's the portrait mode. Now you'll see. Okay. Uh, turn the camera. With this button here. Okay. So now you'll see. Okay. I'll have to get out of the frame. Okay. That should be good. So. Uh, okay. So this is the natural light one. So you see that it's allowing her to click the picture. Okay. So go ahead. Click a picture. Okay, uh, browse down to the second one. Okay, so this is the studio light one. So you see that it's allowing her to uh, click that too. So click that picture also. Okay, the next one, go to the next one. So this is the contour light one. Let me just focus into that. Okay, so this is the contour light one. So even this is available. Click on that. Okay, now the next two are the problem ones. So you see it says background is too far. So this is the problem that you'll face with the iPhone 10 front camera because it tries to judge the background for a perfect black background. Uh, it needs the depth uh, of the background. So uh, when you are in an open area, it cannot get the depth. So you'll not be able to click a picture. So this is the problem that you face. So even if you click one, okay, go ahead and click a picture. Click one in this and go to the next mode. And you click a picture in this also. Uh, both of them you see background is too far that's the message you'll get now so this is the problem that you'll face so how to get a, ba a blur bag uh, sorry a black background a studio uh, picture uh, is now just go into the pictures now uh, these are the studio ones that we tried to take but we could not get any background blurring but if you go to the other ones you see the background blurring is there all you have to do is go into it hit edit on top now you'll see that you have all these options on the left so you just browse down to studio and you see that the studio option is available now this is the reason why iphone does not allow you to take a picture because it could not get the depth so that's why you see the white uh, background is coming up a little bit so uh, that's the reason why iphone doesn't allow it but this is the hack you can just go into edit and then you can actually put it into black sometimes you do get really good pictures so this is okay not that great but I'll still try to edit another one. Okay, I have this. Let me try editing this. And I go into the black one. Okay, so even this is decent. Uh, it did leave out a little bit of the background. But I am still able to take the stage light picture. So that's how you can get a stage light picture. So you've seen uh, how to get any portrait mode picture uh, so basically this is the information that i wanted to give you that when you click with the iphone 10 front camera you are actually getting all the portrait mode pictures at the same time so you do not have to focus on one because a lot of people are confused that which portrait mode should i choose so you actually don't have to choose just click with any one of them and then go into edit and change it to whatever you prefer so that's it that's it for this video if you like the video please subscribe with the like button and do comment and i'll see you again with another video bye 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 bye